Hey guys, Sherry here, and I'm gonna talk to you today about how to set up your Dymo Label Writer to use with Inventory Lab. So if you've been using the 30up labels and printing on Amazon, this will save you time and money. The labels are fractions of a penny, and uh, you know, you don't need ink since they're thermal printers. So first off, we got our Dymo Label Writers from Amazon.com, and we, get, we got the 450 turbos, we paid between 60 and 70 both times. So these are right in line price wise. The kind of labels that we use are the house labels. We go um, with the seller house labels on eBay. We use the 30336. And the cool thing with these is you can buy two, you can buy 50. They have all different variations um, of price points. I recommend getting it for at least a quarter um, so you have plenty of labels and you don't run out because that is a bummer when you're doing a big shipment and you realize you don't have any labels. So let's get started. Um, there's a couple of different ways to do this. Inventory Lab, when you log in, goes to here. Now, if you go to the user guide and you go to printer setup, You can click Dymo here or here. This will walk you by, walk you through step by step. Um, if you are using Chrome, you need to go to this page. Now, this is these steps here, starting at number four are if you have not already installed the label writer software that comes with the Dymo when you purchase it. And you'll notice it just goes step by step. I mean, just literally you just follow the steps and the instructions here. So I'm not gonna go through how to set up your, uh, the software that comes with the Dymo because there's instructions in the box that you with the Dymo and then there's instructions here with pictures. Um, if you already have put the, uh, already installed the software that comes with the Dymo, then you go ahead and start here at 21. So I'm going to go ahead and show you on here. When you come in, you just do the drop down, go to settings, then that's going to take you to this page. Printer setup is what you click. Then you just click run setup. This will have no values when you do yours. You click run setup, you click Dymo, next. We've already installed our um, software, so you click Next. You click what Dymo you have, Label, and uh, you want the roll on the left. So that's where you go to do that. And then what it'll do is it'll bring this up. It'll bring a page that says, is this all correct? And you click Save. Now right here, automatically print labels after submitting. I have that so that anytime you've created a uh, an item to sell, it'll automatically print the number of labels that you put in. And then print with high quality on the littler labels. Um, I really recommend doing this with the, uh, so you have the high quality print. Um, and I really think that is it for the setup. So again, if you guys have questions, drop them in the group. There'll be a Q&A post. Uh, we'll look forward to talking to you. Thanks. Bye.